the world today in which we live within, mm -hmm. you know, it's a lot of things, changes, a lot of things you see, a mm -hmm. lot of happenings, you know. <laughs> The world today in which we live within, mm -hmm. you know, it's a lot of things, changes, a lot of things you see, a mm -hmm. lot of happenings, you know, lot, you know, and <coughs> that has been done to our people in a lot of environments and... Mm -hmm. how, how, lo how long have you been singing now, Jayut? Well, since I'm going 15 years now, 40, really? 15 yeah. years. Do you remember the first song that you, that you recorded? It was called The Movie Man. The Movie Man, yeah. Right. Mm. Have you ever, like say, we cut that since, since we did it originally? No. I think it might be a good idea, man. Maybe. Yeah, you know, family, <laughs> you know, family has a big youth and it's doing over his original song. Like, what are some of the other music that you find worthwhile listening to or you, you enjoy listening to? Now that you're in America and seeing different aspects of No, things. like, look, man, like, a, you have a thing, the, the word is music, you know what right. I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And you have music in all yeah. kind of standard, you mm -hmm. know, like, there's a lot of music that carry message, it doesn't matter the direction that the beat is going in. Right. Uh -huh. You right. know, but mm -hmm. there's something meaningful exactly. to it, whether emotionally or spiritually. spiritually. Exactly, something is happening within the list and the, and the music. Yeah, because, you know, I deal mm -hmm. with music, mm -hmm. you know, I'm not like a partial listener to music. I just deal with music and like I'm more like the music with the message that carries. Uh -huh. I mean. Are there any, any artists in, that you find that you enjoy listening to most or, or prefer to listen to in opposition to the particular music but the particular artists that you like the way they approach or the, their pattern or they go about the business of music? Well, you see me now, it's like you all Diana Ross and them coats. Mm -hmm. It's mm -hmm. favorite of them kind of, yeah. uh -huh. you know, them lady mm -hmm. singers. Mm -hmm. Like lady singers. <laughs> like, mm -hmm. over the years, man, you have, people, you have great writers like Gamble Off and them mm -hmm. thing, or come mm -hmm. up with some great acts, you know. Mm -hmm. Well, I just admire the works, because sure. it carry feelings. <laughs> so what does Big U see in the future for reggae? Well, like with great works and cause you have some great hacks, you know. I don't mm. like to just pick on names, but you have mm. great hacks that do meaningful things, you mm. know, that like education mm -hmm. to the whole scene, you know, people that really go through times and feel it, you know, right. and mm. know what they feel so they really have to express it, you know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And How do you feel about, like, say, uh, these British groups like the Clash and the Police, UB40? who, uh, from time to time, has, have tremendous success with reggae, a reggae influence or synchronization or beat in their music. Well, that's why... Right. Mm, in that's opposition to, like, say, the original reggae people or artists have not having the same results. It's, you know? it's, it's like a thing, you know, it's, it's a thing named the media, you know what I'm saying? Mm. So, there's a lot of things where, if it gets to present, you know, you present a project. To, it's like a, yeah, it's just the mm -hmm. marketing and the presentation, because mm -hmm. there's a lot of people doing a lot of work, but right. the work is not just going out, you know. Mm -hmm.